blessing, but it's also a curse. When I'm deep in depression, that's the time that it works. My best material is written when everything's pivotal. Each thought is critical. It's like the tears from my eyes rains on the pain and becomes a lubrication for the thoughts in my brain. Let it go, let it go, let it go. It's Eastern Conference Bliss as the Charlotte Bobcats come into town for this one. Bringing you the NBA here on 2K Sports with Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. This is Kevin Harlan. Welcome, everyone. So let's take a look at the starters for the Charlotte Bobcats. Henderson out there with Kemba Walker. Then it's Sangana Jop. Then there's Boris Diaw. And it's Maggetti in at the three, the small forward. And for New Jersey... Jaron Williams and Anthony Morrow man the backcourt. Outlaw and Humphreys, they make up the forwards. And it's Lopez in at the center. Charlotte calls timeout. You know, in 2010, Charlotte made the playoffs, but it wasn't because of their play on the road and their poor performance in that department carried into last season. Tyrus Thomas has checked in for the Bobcats. Here's Walker. Shoots from the high post. Good. More on Charlotte. Both years just winning 13 wins in 41 road games. And you don't give yourself a lot of room for error to make the playoffs when you play that poorly on the road. That means you have to be almost perfect at home. Tight spot there to put it in. Perfect pass. Horace Burke had a chance to catch up with head coach Avery Johnson. On the defensive end of the court, guys, he said the effort would be anchored by their big men, who he expects to wreak a little havoc in the low post with their shot-blocking prowess. Back to you. Great stuff, Doris. Thanks. That's a mantra. Clark, we're going to hear, I think, a lot from coaches. Defense first. Yeah, you hear it all the time, Kevin, and that's the identity they want to have today, and I think it'll work for them as long as they execute it. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's one thing to say it, but you got to bring it, and I think this team has to show great energy and aggression early on if they're going to win this game. They get it back, feeds it to Henderson, lets it go from deep, can't hit, and it's New Jersey the other way. Not his forte. I don't really like that shot, and you can tell the defense is just asking him to take it. Morrow, that's a two-pointer. Good, and it's Williams who picks up the assist. Guys, how good is Williams at the record against Eastern Conference opponents did not help. On the court right now for the Bobcats. We've got Kemba Walker. Sagana Jop is out there with Tyrus Thomas. Then it's Maggetti. When you have to see the Heat, Magic, and Atlanta Hawks four times a year. Those are all playoff teams. One of the For Sheldon Williams. Williams, that's good. You know, for a guy like him who can light it up like that, that's too easy. Here's Walker. Ten points for him. Lopez. It's rebounded by Charlotte. Maggetti's got his fourth rebound in this one. Gets it to go. He's got 12. Even with the D lurking. He made it look easy with the soft finger roll. Here's Williams. The Bobcats pull it in. The most they've trailed by is nine points. Hammers the alley-oop through. Boy, that is an alley-oop of the highest order <laughs> on the front and back end. Well, a play they've been working on. it. First first the foul. Here's Maggetti. And now we've got the intentional foul. Sinks the first one, and that increases their lead to six. At the one. Two for two, and it's a seven-point ball game. Nice job to make them all. That's a big play to extend their lead. Timeout called the Nets. They trail by seven. We've got 22 seconds left in the game. Here is Williams. 
Here's Morrow. Now he's their top rebounder. He's doing an excellent job on the glass today. Boy, I tell you what, I love the effort.